It's from the James Joyce of the Dead. It's my audition for James Joyce of the Dead. Emily Skinner and I went to college together. Really good buddy of mine. Long story short, I could not get an audition for this show to save my life. I had no Broadway credits. I looked Irish, but nothing like Alice and Emily. <laughs> so, you know, who were like, you know, the Swiss Alps twins. So I just, there was no way I was getting in there. And Emily, being my friend, uh, went up to the director her herself and said, you need to see my friend during lunch hour. Um, and the only thing is when you offer, when you give her the job, you let me call her. So, and then that night, it, my audition was the next day. I had nothing, I had no material, anything. Alice and Emily were on the phone with me all night telling me how to do their scenes all night long after they finished their show. So they said, you need to sing an Irish song. And I'm Irish, you know. So it's not like, you know, Finian's Rainbow for me. It's like, you know, pub closing for me. <laughs> so I said, is this like, and I'm an Irish Irish song or is this like, you know, Lucky Charms Irish? And they were like, no, 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 it's Irish Irish. So I was like, great. So I said, I'm gonna sing Parting Glass, which my grandmother used to sing to me. And uh, so I get there, you know, and I'm paranoid because I hear like, you know, crazy, like through the magic door theory, you know, where everybody, there's no vocal problems at all with the other person on the other side, it's a magic door. Yeah. And they're singing like before the parade passes by and I can cook too and stuff. And I panicked and I was like, no, 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 I'm gonna sing the Irish song. So I go in and uh, this, is, this is what I sang. That air I had, I spent it in good company, and oh, and that air I done, alas, it was to none but me. And I'll softly 